Hi, this is Bipolar. I uh, wanted to I wanted to talk to myself, I guess you could say. And uh, let's see how this video comes out with me talking about what's going on with me. And uh, I guess you is it is it really a disease, a compulsive behavior to obsess buying to feel like you have to buy? no matter how much money you really do have. Yeah, I'm one of those many people that are in debt when we don't necessarily have to be in debt. Uh, I love my husband. I love my children. I, I don't mean to do what I do. And I feel like crap right now because and I know you guys are going to go, but you really need that. Okay, I have celiac, so I really have to buy things that are gluten-free. I know many of you out there would say, yeah, but vegetables is gluten-free. Everything that's health products. I agree. But uh, I find myself so much more easier to buy. I'm doing dishes, sorry, guys. I, I find myself so m a lot easier to just buy some of those frozen, gluten-free, you know, products out there. And they do feel good, and, and they don't hurt my belly, and it's a quick one, two, three, microwave. Yes, nuke. We are in the world of nuking everything, just to sit down and eventually do nothing, as, as far as for me. Um... My husband's been immensely pissed off, and it hurts me, even though he thinks I don't care. I don't show my emotions very well. I am one of those that when I piss someone off, I laugh. And it's my nerves. And it, it's uh, taken as rude, uh, intentional, uh, meant to do it you want to see me pissed off kind of a feeling for others who don't, who don't understand that nervous, nervousness can be shown with uh, laughing. When does it hit me? When he's not around. That's when I say, shit. I don't, I don't really want him to feel that way. I, I went to a food store. I mean, we only had about $900 in the bank account. <clears throat> but I... Sometimes I do skip my lunch, and I do want to eat something that has high protein and is gluten-free, and I don't want to have to cook. I, I don't care too much for meat. <laughs> I'm not a, a my, my, my stomach doesn't do well with meat, so or eggs, you know, or dairy. So uh, I buy these uh, kind of nutritional bars that, suppo yes, supplement, yes, but I just... I'm too lazy to get up and do something. It's the truth. Look at me. I'm in my pajamas. Many, many, many people that have gone, uh, have been uh, strong enough to get out of this rut may have seen yourself in a pajama all the day. Yeah, I was one of those. I'm so sorry. Yeah. Yeah. Uh... I'm in a rut, and I, I'm feeling really crappy. I, I bought, I bought a lot of my nutritional stuff, and it's as if, yeah, I, I'm only thinking about myself, not my kids. For me, I, uh, I find myself, uh, yeah, go ahead, play your iPad. First thing they do is wake up in the morning, they play with their iPad, and I wake up, I have my coffee, I don't want to be bothered, so I sit down and I drink my coffee. I'm on my iPad. We have a TV on, and everybody in this house has an iPad. Um, my punishment to them is you can't have your iPad. Um, today I've taken away iPads to everyone and they're playing imaginary, but it wasn't easy to, to, to get them off their iPad. And here I am, I'm videotaping off of a, an iPad and I've been using it. What kind of example is that? Um, had to sit down. Yes, you can. I had them on timeout also. Um, 
today they had a big argument because they were off iPad. So it, it, they had to resolve their own issue as far as which color bowl was theirs. <clears throat> Even though both of them had cereal. I dumped them both out on the table. I said, okay, now you don't have a bowl color. Are you going to pick which side of the cereal you want? Um, eventually they both decided they're going to eat out of one bowl, the one they were complaining on, which they thought they both had the red one, had a red and green one. And sometimes as a parent you say to yourself, let me just give them the same color bowl. Well, what are they going to learn out of that? They're not going to learn anything, are they? Uh, so at least they both came to the agreement that they would eat out of the same color bowl. And I basically on the table, I have it lined with a pencil and uh, all I did was the bowl stays within this square so if you're both going to hold on a second so if you're both going to eat from this bowl you can't be put, tugging it back and forth and they did great yes it <laughs> I know parenting means you have to be involved in and teaching your children <sighs> I'm just very selfish and I'm going to do part two, all right? Um, uh, it's therapy to me. Uh, hopefully, in some odd way, this will help you, because I'm sure when I look at this again, this may help me. Um, see you again, part two. Bye. Love, love.